Hello, so this is Michael. Um, welcome to uh, this chapter on teaching you how to set up your local development server and also how to purchase a domain and also set up a hosting account. So this should take um, less than 30 minutes for you to do if you're not buying a hosting account or a domain. Uh, if you're going to go and purchase your own domain, um, we recommend that you go through GoDaddy and uh, HostMonster is a good hosting account. Uh, I've tried multiple uh, other hosting, hosting accounts and we uh, like hosting HostMonster quite a bit. So uh, if you do decide to buy a hosting account, you can use our affiliate link which is uh, on the website and we get a little bit of kickback and that helps us at Village 88. Uh, but if you don't uh, need a hosting server, that's fine. Uh, you can just uh, set up your own server on your local host, which we show you how to do, and that will help you to uh, learn and do all the things that you need to do. So what you're going to learn in this course is we're going to teach you just, a, just very basics of how internet works, uh, what IP addresses are, you know, what happens when you type something in your, in your browser. Uh, after we do that, we um, help you install uh, WOMP, which stands for Windows, Apache, MySQL, and PHP. So it takes about um, probably five minutes to install it, and it is, it's just a, one of the best tools out there for you to start uh, developing websites right away. And uh, later on, when you go into MySQL and PHP, um, it's already installed, and you can start um, creating database-driven website just right from your computer. So that's going to just take a few minutes for you. After that, we're going to show you uh, what we think is the best way to develop uh, application. There are other tools out there, but we feel that like, you know, the best programmers just use text editor. And there is one tool that we uh, use uh, a lot and we really like it. So we're going to introduce you to that tool and tell you how to use it. So once this is done, you're going to know how to uh, set up your own server or if you go and purchase a domain and a server you will know how to buy your own domain and when you go to the web server how you can set it up so that uh, everyone that you know can go to the website and uh, see the work that you did. So uh, that's it. Enjoy the course.